Let's talk about the analytics feature in Napoleon Cat. Before you analyze any profiles in Napoleon Cat, you first need to connect them. Hit the link in the top right corner for a how to video. Remember that after connecting a profile, please allow up to 24 hours for Napoleon Cat to process and collect the data. With the analytics feature, you can monitor your results on social media. You can also monitor your competitors or any other public profiles, draw inspiration from others, establish your own KPIs, see the bigger picture, and ultimately refine your social strategy. Analytics work with Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, and LinkedIn. Let me give you a quick rundown. You access the analytics feature by clicking on this icon on the far left. Here you'll have a list of your connected profiles. The ones at the top are your managed profiles, and the ones with the little eye icon are the accounts that you follow. These may be your competitors, for example. Let's click on our managed Facebook profile. On the right, you'll have the option to set a custom time period for your analysis. If you're looking for data that reaches back further than two months, just contact us, and we should be able to help you out with that. You can have your data presented to you in a daily, weekly, or a monthly breakdown. Anyway, here are all these different tabs that pertain to specific metrics. These tabs will differ depending on which social platform we're analyzing. For a Facebook profile, you have the summary that includes all the basic metrics. You can download the data in an Excel sheet or a PNG file. Let's move on to another tab. Reach, with metrics like total reach, fans growth, page fans by country, there's a lot of data to work with. Feel free to pause the video to get a better look at these metrics. We have the impressions tab. We have the engagement metrics here. With these metrics, you can see how users react to your content. Let's move to the content tab. With the help of this data, you can figure out your best times to post on Facebook. You can see how well your posts perform in terms of comments, reactions, shares, lifetime, and engagement rate. You'll also have the reach broken down into paid and viral. By looking at such data, you can see which kind of content generates the highest engagement. In other words, you can figure out what to post. By accessing the video tab, you can also analyze your videos. You can analyze the performance of the hashtags that you used in your posts. And you can also check your page's top fans inside the Influencers tab. If you'd like to see the aggregated data from all your social profiles, you can create a social footprint. Social footprints allow you to see how you're doing across various social media platforms. So, you click on Add New Group, name your group, and select your profiles. And there you go. You can see the number of your followers across different platforms, the engagement rate, and you can also see a daily breakdown of all of your followers' interactions with your account. You can also create a social footprint for other public profiles and track your competitors. This allows you, for example, to compare how different brands perform across different social media channels and gives you a broader picture of your competitors. And since you share your target audience with your competitors, analyzing their social media will give you even more insights on what to post and when, and also which social media channels to choose. Finally, you can create data sets and compare stats for various social profiles. Simply add the profiles and you'll be able to compare all the metrics available in our analytics section against each other. If you wish to conquer social media, just hit the link down below and sign up for our free two-week trial. And if you have any questions, just contact us through our website and we'll be more than happy to help you guys. Until next time, bye bye.